Janie, welcome back to the Bookworms, buddy. Today I'm doing a video covering my Pick 5 Challenge. This is my wrap-up. The Pick 5 Challenge is a challenge that I did with Shannon, or I'm doing with Shannon, this year where we pick five books for each other. I picked five for her, she picked five for me, and what we tried to do was pick books out of the comfort zone of the other. And the whole concept of the challenge is fantastic, and I would love to do more Pick 5 Challenges uh, in the upcoming years. Um, so anyway, first let me tell you the books that I picked for her, and then I will tell you the books she picked for me. So for Shannon, I picked Patient Zero by Jonathan Mayberry. You know I love that book. Left to Die by Lisa Jackson, another favorite. Before I Go to Sleep by S.J. Watson, I want to say. Um, if I'm wrong, I'll put that on the screen. Um, Alice in Zombieland by Gina Showalter and Dolores Claiborne by Stephen King. Um, these are five of my favorite books for the year that I read in 2014. However, they're not her favorite books. Um, they are pretty well out of her comfort zone. So, I don't know. I know she read Dolores Claiborne. I don't know if she's gotten to any of these other books. But I was determined to get through mine. So for me, she picked Cinder, Prisoner of Night and Fog, A Monster Calls, Amy and Roger's Epic Detour, and I'll Give You the Sun. And these are really out of my comfort zone. And like I used to say, like in the beginning of the year, I read Cinder pretty early. And I kept saying that um, had she not picked that book, I probably still wouldn't have picked it up to read it. I read that one relatively early in the year and actually absolutely loved that book, the whole series, I actually caught up on the whole series and I'm waiting now for winter to come out which is supposed to be um, this month I believe so yeah I'll be looking for that one um, I did read Prisoner of Night and Fog, A Monster Calls and Amy Rogers Epic Detour in September I read all three of those, I went to the library and got all the books out, the rest of them that I needed because I didn't own them I only owned Cinder and I said I'm gonna read these books I believe Cinder was a five star. Monster Calls was three star. Prisoner of Light and Fog was five. And Amy and Roger's Epic Detour was five. I also picked up I'll Give You the Sun. And. So sorry. I got to just about page 50 and. I couldn't do it. I, I couldn't do it. Um, I didn't even listen to my wrap up because, and I didn't review it and, and rate it because I didn't feel like I had the, the right to give it a rating considering I only got to 50. It just wasn't grabbing me. I just didn't get it. I wasn't going to struggle through it when I've got, you know, other books that I need to get read. So, sorry Shannon, I just did not like, uh, I'll give you the song. This is by Jandy, Jandy Nelson. Yeah, I hate to not like a book but that one I just I couldn't finish it so I did pretty well I got four out of the five books read for the most part they were they were great books I absolutely loved them so anyway Shannon let me know how you are doing if you are continuing with these books because it's getting close to the end of the year um, yeah so anyway that is my pick five challenge wrap up I had a lot of fun with it Shannon thank you we ought to do this again uh, it just opens your eyes up to books that you would not normally think that you would like so I'm very happy that I liked the majority of these books so that is it for this uh, video let me know if you read any of these books what you thought of them and we'll talk about it thanks guys for staying tuned and I'll see you in the next video bye